Green Bay firefighters are calling a new state law the Arne Wolf Law. The law allows families of firefighters who died in the line of duty to retain their health insurance coverage. Now, it's a state ordered law, obviously, but local municipalities would be the ones who would have to pay the premiums. Fox 11's Laura Smith has multiple views. A 2006 house fire claimed the life of Green Bay Fire Lieutenant Arnie Wolf. Wolf left behind a wife and three children. As soon as Arnie passed away, his family's insurance with the city lapsed. Now there's a new state law designed to protect the families of firefighters killed on the job. We like to call it the Arnie Wolf Bill, just as another remembrance of Arnie. The law requires municipalities to pay health insurance premiums for survivors of fallen firefighters. It covers a dependent child in school up to age 27. The law does not apply to a spouse who remarries or reaches age 65. Yeah, Green Bay firefighter Rich G says Galloway. few Wisconsin firefighters have died in the line of duty, but the law gives added protection should it occur. And it's one of those things you never think of until it happens. Democratic Senator Dave Hansen sponsored the bill, which Governor Doyle signed into law with Wolf's family looking on. There shouldn't be undue burden on a family that has to pay for the health insurance premiums. They should be able to be carried as they were uh, still working. The Wisconsin Alliance of Cities says while the law is easily seen as just and fair, it's an issue unions should take up at the bargaining table. By going to the legislature, they are given that benefit without the need for quid pro quo which means that the property taxpayer pretty much takes it on the chin for this one. Also opposed is the League of Wisconsin Municipalities. Green Bay Mayor Jim Schmidt sits on the board. However, Schmidt says the city does not object to the law. He says tragic things happen and the city will help families of fallen firefighters in need. It will cost the city a little money, but in the grand scheme of things, it's a small price to pay for somebody who gave the ultimate sacrifice to the city of Green Bay. In Green Bay, Laura Smith, Fox 11 News. There's been no estimate yet on exactly how much the law will cost municipalities, and it is retroactive to situations that have happened in the past. According to the State Firefighters Memorial website, 24 firefighters have been killed in the line of duty since 2001.